The Calgary Planning Commission gave us some instructions. They said, we see this as the gateway to the city, and when people are leaving the city, it's the gateway to the mountain. The stones float in the um, in these steel uh, cribs that have been built, and when you look at them, you can actually see the water ripples from the lake that was here 227 million years ago. There are also the fossils of animals from the seabed at that time. And so they're a really interesting uh, connection back to this land, the immemorial times of the land. But also, it's foreshadowing those tall towers that you see downtown in the distance. And the idea was to bring this sort of tower and rock together. And those four towers relate to the Blackfoot cultural symbolism that talks about the four elements, the four stages of life, the four seasons. You know, it's a pretty big challenge to say, we've got this uh, massive six-lane highway, but we kind of want to have a gate on it, a gateway feel. So it needs to have a certain size and presence and monumentality, um, which is tricky to do with anything else. I mean, you couldn't do it with a mural. Uh, a, a single sculpture might look a little lost in space. And so I think, uh, I think people uh, need to consider what are the what are the challenges of this particular kind of site and what kind of approach do we want to see as we enter the city? And, uh, and I think they'll become um, landmarks in much the same way that uh, if you think about the Arctic landscape and, and the kind of landmarks that Inukshuk's become.